Hi guys, this is Sprite. I'm the graphic artist here at Condé Systems. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a printable color chart in Corel Draw so that you can color match the colors on your monitor to what your printer actually outputs. In order to do that, we must first create a new document by clicking on File, then New. You can also click Control N or click the new document icon at the top left of your screen. After that is complete, you need to set up the default page size by clicking on Tools, then Options. Also Control J will open this dialog box. You want to click on Document, then click Save Options as Defaults, and make sure that the Page Options tab is selected. Click on OK. And you, make sure, you want to make sure that the palette you want to use is open by clicking on Window, then coming down to Color Palettes and making sure that the color palette you are going to print today is selected. So today we're just going to do the RGB palette and it is selected. Now in order for Corel to create this palette, we need to ask it to run the macro. And so in order to do that, we just click on Tools, Macros, and then Run Macro. So now that the dialog box has appeared, we need to select All Standard Products, excuse me, All Standard Projects, and then click on Create Color Swatch. Hit Run. Make sure that your palette is selected. Use the drop down menu. We are using the RGB palette. You have the option here to add a header with the date and your printer, and then the thumbnail spacing. The larger the spacing, the more pages you're going to print. So uh, a five spacing is pretty good. Just click on OK, and then Corel will create the color chart for you. So here it is. We have two different pages and these are all the colors that are on my color chart. So now we are just ready to print and press to whatever substrate you would like to match your colors to. So this is a really easy way to make sure that what you're seeing on your monitor is the actual output that your printer is going to create. I hope this video was helpful and as always thanks for watching and happy sublimating.